hello guys today's video i am going to show you how to fix the problem of windows script host error in windows 10 or windows 11 if you have the same problem then i am fixing this problem in very simple and easy way first step is you have to go to your windows search bar and here you can type the registry editor so when you type it the registry editor you can open it and it will show on the top you have to just click on the yes and here you will see the H key current user you can just expand this and expand this software option and here you will see the microsoft so you have to just expand this and now you will see the option of windows script host you can just double click on it and click on this settings and just you can right click and click on new and select third and you can just type here the enable you can rename it to enable and just double click on this and here you can type the value of one in hexadecimal and click on the ok so after this step you have to just close these all tabs and here you will see so we are moving to our next step which is the H key current user you have to just expand this and now here you have to just trying to find the dot pbs file and you can just uh, scrolling down and if you find the dot pbs file here you will see the persistent handler you can just double click on it and click on this this file and here you can just type the value of vbs file and cut this and type vbs file so when you type it click on this ok option and cut this so now we are moving to our next step which is you can go to your windows search bar and here type cmt and run as administrator and click on yes so after it will be open you have to just type a command sfc space less scan now so when you type it and click enter so here you will see it is scanning for the r crypted files in our windows or c drive so when it was complete we are going to our next step which is you can go to any browser and type the microsoft shift scanner and open this microsoft learn website so when you open it here you have to just uh, scrolling down and download this microsoft scanner 64 bit if you have the 64 bit so after the downloading is complete you have to just drag and drop it to your desktop and open this so when you open here you can just tick this i accept and click on the next and here you can just select the quick scan and click on the next so it is scanning our c drive and setting for the all crypted files so after this when this scanning was complete you have to just click on this finish option and here you will see the our command prompt and it was completed the scanning of our c drive and it is remove our r integrity violation now you have to just restart your pc and see if your problem is solved or not i hope after this your problem will be solved and please subscribe to our channel for more useful videos like this and for my motivation